Hey everybody, it's John from the Gamer Duel here. Today is a special day nonetheless, as we're continuing our Pokemon Blue randomized Nuzlocke. Um, I'm excited because today we're going to record one episode, so only one episode is going to be recorded today. Um, which means that I got to record like a bunch in another day. Um, my school has still not yet to contact me, so apparently they want to lose $5,000 in ex like, okay. I mean, if they want to lose 5k, go ahead. For losing 5k for a $1,700 gain, it definitely makes sense. And actually, like, yeah, like, the whole reason they're doing this is because they want me to do, like, something uh, for $1,700. But, um, they're being stupid. Long story short. And I'm like, okay, I'm not going to pay $1,700 for something that I've already clearly demonstrated um, that I know. Okay, so let's go to the stats. That's that's beyond the point. We got Char the Charizard with Body Slam, Thunder Punch, Solar Beam, and Fire Blast. We got Ty the Victory Bell with Mega Drain, Vine Whip, Sleep Powder, and Sludge. We have eighty PM with Stomp, Tackle, Double Team, and Payday, which is actually kind of a decent move set now. We have Cipher with the moves Thunderbolt, Tri Attack, Thunder Punch, and Flamethrower. We have Kawhi with the level 32, we're not we're gonna try to use sparingly with fire blast, vine whip, stomp, and psychic. And we have uh, J-Rod with cut level 28 with cut hydro cannon or hydro pump bubble beam and something else that I totally skipped over. Anyway, this episode we I bought some Pokeballs because we have three encounters today. So today is definitely one of those episodes where we have a lot going on. And we're gonna try and get it done in a short period of time. So hopefully we can get a good good encounters because that's that's gonna be the key, I think. Because we already have a decent team. I mean we have an up and coming Charizard. We got we've got cores. I would like to have a better normal type other than Wigglytuff. So like a Tauros would be fine, a Snorlax would be fine as well. Um But we're going on to Route 9, and Route 9, I'm a l I'm not nervous about it at all, to be honest. I feel like Route 9 is just gonna be here like I don't feel like Route 9 is going to pose too much of a threat, to be honest. I feel like, I don't know, I don't think the trainers will, but I do think it'll be hard to get, get the Pokemon on Route 9 because our levels are so high in comparison to what the wild Pokemon are, it's just going to get crazier. So this Bug Catcher is, oh, it has an Arcanine. I'm sad now. I'm sad. I wanted to use an Arcanine, but freaking, um, Keel died. Kale Doggo died. Oh. Fire spin, are you kidding me? Oh, body slam was the other move, okay. I'm gonna bubble beam. That O code. Bell Sprout's next. Bell Sprout Char can handle, no problem. Just fire blast the crap out of the Bell Sprout. And then Grimer is next. Grimer is an interesting Pokemon. Seeing as we don't have an official psychic type. Um I kinda wanna get Char more experience. So we're gonna go into Char. And just thunder punch it. And then coughing. Another poison type. Another thing that's kinda interesting and I don't I didn't know what to do with it, but we, we got we got past it, so that's the beauty. We've had TM16. Okay, hopefully that's a good TM. I'm gonna walk right past him. I'm gonna try and fight the elite as little trainers as possible. Oh. I think he's mandatory. Oh no, he's not. Ha ha ha. He's probably mandatory. Yeah, he is mandatory. Darn. Well, he's not mandatory, but he's mandatory to get to the root. To get my root knight encounter, I have to fight him. Um, Buttcatcher wants to fight. He has a Kabuto to start. That's fine, because I can Thunder Punch the crap out of that, and that dies. Kangaskhan is next. and With a Kangaskhan, you know what? I'm going to switch into J-Rod. J-Rod needs some experience. We want J-Rod to level up, too. Everybody needs to level up. Okay. Route 9. What are you going to give me? Legendary Claws is on, so I can't encounter a Legendary. Sadly. Um, but I don't really mind that because like, you can't catch legendaries in this game. Like at all. A Butterfree! Butterfree's not bad. Because I can switch into Ty. Ty's like, can be a very good Pokemon for this. Um, Leech Life. That does absolutely nothing. Like, two damage. Oh, dang. Oh, that was a crit. That's why. Wow. Okay, I don't actually mind the crit, honestly. Oh, we missed. 
There, Butterfree fell asleep. Which means Butterfree should easily be able to freaking get caught. I'm gonna go ahead and use a Pokeball because we have 70 of them, like. Bam! We got the Butterfree. Butterfree is in the decks. We're gonna name this Dario. Dario, thank you for your support on the series so much. It's greatly appreciated. You are now officially a Butterfree. Dario the Butterfree. And you can't sleep on Butterfree. In this generation, Butterfree was actually a very good Pokemon. So there's no sleeping on Butterfree. Mankey. Okay, Mankey. Is, I'm gonna freaking Thunder Punch the crap out of that too. Weezing. Time to Thunder Punch the crap out of another thing. Oh! Whoa, I'm poisoned. Uh, I'm gonna go into J-Rod. There, we killed it. I was a little worried because it was it was healing itself up with like a recover or something. Item. We bought antidotes, right? Apparently I'm still stupid enough not to buy antidotes. That sounds right. Okay. So basically that means that I can't really use char. Okay, Venonat, die. Meowth is also gonna die. And Polyrath is also gonna die. Cypher just freaking O-code everything in its path right there. So I'm just gonna go to the Pokemon Center because it's right here. Yeah, it's right, literally right here. We kind of made it real quickly. I did not think we were gonna make it this quickly, but we did, and there's nothing... I can't complain about it. We... So I can go up here. I can either fish for a level 5 Pokemon, which I'm not going to do. I'm going to get my encounter on Route 10 over there. But I'm going to just fight all these people. Because might as well fight all of these people. Tentacruel, die. Haunter, die. Everything's just dying instantaneously, and it's, it's it's so it feels nice to kill something instantaneously like that. I know that sounds super wrong. Oh, die! Pikachu, die! Psyduck, die! Cipher is the best Pokemon ever. Die! <laughs> Everything just straight up dies, and it's awesome. Well, we killed literally everything on the block. We had to fight this trainer yet. Cedra, die. Gyarados, sadly you have to die. Uh, what else? Goldeen also has to die. We <laughs> Water types galore. Hey, everything must everything dies at some point. That's the title of this episode. Everything die everything dies at some point. Um then you guys are going to think that Kawhi dies, and then it's going to be like, Oh my god, uh, Kawhi died, and then you realize that Kawhi didn't die, and I'm just talking about all these water types that literally are just getting straight destroyed by Cypher. And then you're going to be mad for clickbait, but, I mean, I wasn't even clickbaiting, because technically clickbait's not, that's not clickbait in my opinion. Because everything did die. Oh, that's dupes! Hold on. Ah, Species Claws! I have to run from it. I wanted to use it! Arcanine's so awesome! <gasps> oh! Mascot! I We got the mascot, my friends! We are catching the mascot. I'm actually more happy about this than the Arcanine, but obviously because I'm going to be able to use my mascot because we all know that the Pokemon is going to die at some point. Everything dies at some point. So therefore, we're going to be able to use Gyarados at some point because everything dies at some point. 
So, Gyarados, go to sleep, my boy. Um, or girl, you don't have a gender because this game does not have genders. Um, okay, can we catch you? Actually, I want to use a Great Ball. You're, you're important enough to use a Great Ball on. Ah. Gyarados woke up, turn one. Makes sense. Okay, don't, don't do a lot of damage, don't do a lot of damage. Okay, good. It was considered not very effective. See, these tables are weird. Like, I'm not used to these tables being what they are. Okay, I'm not gonna risk hitting it again. Because it looks like it's about 50% right now. We got the mascot, baby! So, um... Gyarados, the atrocious Pokemon. Okay. Okay. Excuse me. It is not an atrocious Pokemon, okay? It is the absolutely not an atrocious Pokemon. Fix your titles, Game Freak. It's only my favorite Pokemon for a reason. It's not atrocious. Hello? That's okay. Okay, never mind. New title. My mascot's atrocious, apparently. Um, I'm literally coming up with titles on the spot. Obviously, we're naming this after myself because, um, duh. It's only, it's only like my mascot and everything. Dude, that's exciting. I get to use my mascot. Get to use my mascot. Okay, so, well, maybe. Probably. Now, Rock Tunnel, I already know who I'm gonna name this. Oh gosh, I can't see a thing. Oh. That's Eradicate. I feel bad for the person who's gonna get nicknamed after this. I'm gonna use it, obviously, because Raticate's not that bad in this generation. But, I mean, actually, that sprite, the, the name that I have in mind, or the person that I'm naming this after, it's kind of, it matches. Like, it, it does match. Just don't, don't die to a, uh, I don't want it. It's Eradicate. I feel like Eradicate will die to whatever I touch it with, to be fair. I'm gonna sludge it. No. Mega Drain. This is the least amount of damage I could possibly do to it. Hopefully it doesn't die. Well, that's okay. I was gonna name it after Metamunch because Metamunch has been out here supporting the series. And it would have worked very well with that big, like, buck tooth um, that the Raticates have. Um, how many minutes have we been recording? Oh, shoot. We've only been recording 12 minutes. It looks like I'm getting through Rock Tunnel today. Or at least gonna try to get through Rock Tunnel. I would have loved to hit Monlee. Or a Kolpa. I can't see anything at all. I literally can't see anything at all, but we're gonna try our hardest. I feel like I can see more than you can see in Gen 3, though. Like, I definitely see more things that I could, than you did in Gen 3. Because you actually kind of see the layout of the place. Oh, I don't have repels. So this is going to be an annoying area, isn't it? Krabby was down here. I feel like it might not be an annoying area, though. Because I remember, like, ways to go. I know I'm supposed to go up there, but I really I recall an item being here. And there's not, so I'm dumb. Oh, let me Mega Drain off of all that health back. No, but I know I have to go up here. Yeah, and there's somebody that wants to fight. Venomoth, huh? Okay, well, we all know who's going in on a Venomoth. Like, freaking Char's out here. Ooh, Substitute. Substitute looks very weird in this game. Flareon's next. Oh, well, I meant to say switch it into a Pokemon, but I guess this game does not want me to switch into a Pokemon. And level up Char to 31. Char's almost there. Char is legit almost leveled up to level 36. How does it feel, Char, to be almost a Charizard? Char the Charizard. Oh, Zubat. 
these pesky things. Cypher, get out here and just... I forgot you are not... I 1000% forgot the simple fact. Oh no, we're getting recover stalled. Okay, please. That bad scenario when being poisoned actually is helping right now. Okay, Butterfree. Ah. More things that I want to go into Char in, but now I can't go into Char. So, hopefully this bubble be more. Flareon, stay in. Kill this Flareon. Kill this son of a Flareon. Right on. Vine Whip that into Oblivion. I, um, I feel like we've used... Oh, we have not used any of Cypher's health, really. I just want to be careful with Cypher. I don't want Cypher to die. A Mankey, kill that son of a gun. Vaporeon, kill that son of a gun, too. Ty's level 31, guys. Ty's leveling up. Very quickly. I love having Rhydon's here because the Rhydon's just being here is making this a thousand times easier. J Rod, get out here. Bubble Beam. Blastoise, Ty. Ty's gonna, just gonna kill the, the Blastoise. No problem at all. Radicate, same thing. We all know where you got that Radicate, too. Magikarp, I just caught a Gyarados. Weezing. Oh, that's bad. Weezing's a little bit on the on the bad side, except for J-Rod should be able to kinda deal with it. Nidoqueen. Ow. Why did Poison do so much damage? Now I've got two Poison Mons. Ah, that's not good. Item. Char. And J-Rod. I need to get out of here as fast as possible. Oh, a Persian. Um, Sludge. Raichu, Sludge. Butterfree, Sludge. That was good. We were able to Sludge three Pokemon just right off the bat. Oh, is that it? We're almost there. I feel like we're almost there. Snorlax, Mega Drain. Oh, I did not mean to do that, but it worked. Pidgeot, die. Everything died. Okay. Weezing, no! We have to use Kawhi. Kawhi got poisoned too! Whoop dee doo da! Whoop dee day! Oh no, more people are being poisoned. Fire Blast. Yes, we gotta swap. And a tie. Snorlax again. Snorlax dies as well. Okay. Now we have three mods poison. Aromatherapy would be nice. Like. Legitimately any form. Ugh. Ah. I need like aromatherapy please. Can I go down now? I think that's it. Huh. 
We made it out alive! We made it out alive! Woohoo! Oh, well, maybe not. Maybe not quite! Although, Vaporeon and everything. Ty is level 35. Hello? When did Ty level up so far? Probably when we've had to pretty much destroy everything with Ty. And now Ty is level 36. Like. Kubon! A uh, dig Kubon! Um, okay. 80 p.m. It's your time to shine, I think. Yeah. Gloom? Okay, kill the Gloom too. You got this. Good job, 80 p.m. I've got no moves. 80 p.m. Get out here. Do duo, die. So, we made it to Lavender Town. I feel like that's a good place to stop, right? We're 20, yeah, we're 20 minutes in. This is a good place to stop. We made it to Lavender Town. We had three Pokemon poisoned, um, but our team is just, it's super nice. It's super chill. It's not yet fully evolved, but we're about to have a Charizard, which will make it so it's fully evolved for this generation, because I know Magnemite can evolve into Magneton, which evolves into Magnezone. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, leave a like. I really do appreciate it. It really helps the channel. Hopefully made it all the way through. Because then um, we'll be promoted even more. And I'd appreciate that. So anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. Love you all. And peace.